The e-commerce industry is valued at more than 9 trillion US dollars in the year 2020 and is expected to grow significantly. During the coronavirus pandemic, when the entire world was under lockdown, the e-commerce industry proved itself to be one of the most resilient industries on this planet, delivering valuable food items and products to people in the comfort of their homes. So how will the e-commerce industry transform itself and face the challenges of the future? Well, you're about to find that out on this course. Hi, I'm Deshan and I'm a Digital Transformation Consultant. I have first class honours for my bachelor's degree in Applied Information Technology and I also have a distinction for my master's in Technology Management. Well, this is the value that you're going to get from this course. Well, first we're going to talk about the e-commerce industry and the vital role it plays in society. Next, let's look at a few key insights and market trends of the e-commerce industry to gain a much more deeper understanding on the ground situation of the e-commerce industry. Moving on, let's talk about the challenges of the e-commerce industry. So things like customer loyalty and increasing conversion rates and things like that. After that, let's talk about the opportunities for innovation. So how can we bring innovation into the e-commerce industry? Next, we can talk about something very interesting. It's called Industry 4.0. It's this whole new technological revolution that's changing the world right now. So we can talk about what Industry 4.0 is and what the Industry 4.0 environment is. Next, we can talk about cyber physical systems. So these are smart systems which are able to self-organize, self-optimize and self-learn with minimum human intervention. So we can talk about the benefits of it, the characteristics of it as well as the drawbacks of it. After that, let's talk about the impact of Industry 4.0 on the e-commerce industry. So what are the technologies and what are the things of Industry 4.0 that's impacting and changing, transforming the e-commerce industry? Next, let's look at a few innovative startups and businesses in the e-commerce industry who are using Industry 4.0 technologies. After that, let's talk about the barriers of implementing Industry 4.0. So what's holding us back from implementing Industry 4.0? And finally, we can talk about drivers of implementing Industry 4.0. So what's driving us and pushing us to implement Industry 4.0? So if you're someone in the e-commerce space or if you're someone who's learning about the e-commerce space or if you're someone who's really passionate to know about the future trends of the e-commerce industry, this course is just for you. Don't wait, jump right in and see you in the first lecture.